What's up guys, it's Jack and Jeff from AchievementHunter.com. We are doing some saboteur achievements today. We are doing... Heyo. Uh, you love that, don't you? Never gets old. We're doing Top of the World and High Diver, which is, uh, they both revolve around the Eiffel Tower. Dude, that is so many white dots. <laughs> God, this game has so many things. Okay, so this right here on the map, this little thing that looks like a sea with like the alien things in the middle, that's where the Eiffel Tower is. So if you haven't played the story mission and gotten to it yet, that's where you need to go. Sea with the... Yeah, it looked like something out of contact. So, okay, check it out. So, right here is a checkpoint. Uh -huh. Even if you haven't gotten to this area in the game, you can punch right through those checkpoints, and all you got to do is evade the, the police or whatever. And as soon as you do, um, you don't have to worry about it. It's not like GTA, where if you go to an area you're not supposed to, you're just five-starred the whole time. Right. You can just get past there and just keep playing. And this so. is in Paris Area 3. Right? Yes, yes. And uh, you can get there, I think, right at the start of the game, if I'm not mistaken. So. Yeah, and, and we both did it. We did it two ways. You did it... Yes, I through the story mode, yeah, and I, beat I just the game last first, yeah. and then you just went down there before you got there. So this is my game. You can tell my games because it's uh, it's already liberated, so it's all colorful and stuff. And you got the super race car. Dude, and check stuff. out that car; it's pretty sick. It's pretty awesome. So, how, uh, how do you get that car? Uh, you have to beat uh, Durkadur in a race. Oh, okay. Durkadur. So uh, here's the elevator. It's on this. Uh, what is that? North. East, northwest, I don't know, whatever. On that side of the, uh, the Eiffel Tower, you're gonna take this one up first, and it'll take you up to the second level. Now, here's where we differ. Once, um, so this is Jeff's game. So he's up on the second level. You can see everything's in black and white because my shit's not liberated. <laughs> so you actually have to climb the side of the tower, <laughs> and it takes you, I don't know, how long did it take you to get up there, Jeff? Oh, uh, like five minutes, maybe. Yeah. It's not too bad. So you can make it up. So all you gotta do is get up from the, uh, the second floor here all the way up to the, t or from the second to the third sort of platform, and... Here we go! Turn you can, on the Benny Hill music. You can see, I'm doing a great job here. Yeah, look at you. You're all nervous and stuff. I'm not going to lie to you, Jack. I got a little... Uh, I'm not scared of heights, but I got a little height dizzy Did when you? I was doing this, yeah. You got a, you got a little... It's uh, up there. It's like, you ever play Crackdown, and uh, like when you get to the top of a tall building, you start to get vertigo a little bit? Yeah, yeah. yeah kind of totally. got that here. Nice. So uh, this is a little tricky part here. So there's these little gr uh, like girders that poke out. You actually have to climb up one of those to get to that, that uh, third aye, aye, level. Aye. We, had, we had some issues trying to figure that one out. So, so you're hanging off the top of the world right now while you're doing Basically, this. Basically, yeah. You're not even to the highest point yet. So For some reason, I couldn't get any higher on there that we one. Go. There we go. And so you work your way up. And now. then you can jump out here and then get up here. Oh, yeah, yeah, now, yeah. you can actually see, this is what I did. So that was Jeff doing that stuff. This is what I did. I just got out. This is the second platform where Jeff started from, that last one. And I walked around. Where am I going? I'm looking for the other elevator. Because I can just take an elevator up instead of you know having to climb the side of a freaking tower. So basically what you're saying is if you're impatient, you can do it at the beginning of the game and climb the fucker. If you are lazy, you can just wait till you get there naturally. Exactly. The game, Actually, you know, um, not have to an easier time of it. Not to spoil anything, but I will say the end of the game takes place on the Eiffel Tower. So oh. you could just turn around and get this achievement after you're done with the game. And so, okay, so here we go. We're up on that second floor. And really is pretty self-explanatory. Just keep going up. So I fast forwarded through all this because literally there's only one way to go. Just take it all the way up. There's an elevator in the middle. Jump on that and just keep going up. Climb the ladders. Go up the stair. You like this? <laughs> I love it. It's great. More ladders. More ladders. Final ladder up to the very top. Whew. And there we are on top of the world. Whew. And watch this. Watch this. Watch this crossfade. And whoa. You like that? Oh, look at that. Look that at you. That was pretty cool. I went from oh, you to me. Cool. It nice. made it all colorful. It's like, it's like we're Dorothy on the other side of the rainbow. Now. Yeah. It's all colorful, except it's night. And so now we get the top of the world achievement. Bam. There we go. 15, 15 gamer score. score. Now you got to get down. Yeah. Now we got to get down. And uh, we can take it one of two ways. We can either climb down, which will probably take us, you know, forever. Or you can jump off. And what you're doing is looking for this sort of kidney-shaped pool. And you're going to belly flop into it. Oh, just like reality, you would totally survive that. That's going to leave a mark. And we got the high diver achievement. Look at that. 15 gamer score. So 30 gamer score combined. Just for climbing and then jumping off of a tower. That's and then, uh, you, or you could be Jeff and do that. <laughs> <laughs> so this is after Jeff climbed all the way up there off the side and then, oh, yep. get a little shy. I undershot it. You undershot <laughs> it by a good 20 feet or so. That body did not bounce. <laughs> no, not at all.